I haven't started a video off like this in a minute, y'all. Don't you just love car problems? You know, I was going to vlog me actually going to take my car to the shop, but I was so drained that, honestly, I didn't feel like it, y'all. So, about to start the day off here. I just took my car, dropped off my car. Hopefully, it's something cheap, but it probably ain't. Every time, you know, your car get messed up, you guarantee you're going to spend $200 or more. And, um... Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And um, happy Memorial Day weekend, Saturday, Cleveland, Ohio. Um, last night was smooth, y'all. Honestly, I went home after I studied because I couldn't do Uber last night because my car fucked up. So, therefore, you know, um, I had to come home. You know, I was driving, like, you hear this noise in the back right tire. I kind of already know what it is. It's most likely going to be my wheel bearing. And that's about... $285. It's like as soon as I start making my money back, my money goes away. But that's why I always say you got to have some kind of security money stashed away just in case some weird shit happens, you know. But besides everything else, y'all, let's have a great day and let's roll. <laughs> I finally got my car back, y'all. So now I guess I can start the vlog off, you know, right here, kind of, sort of, in a way, whatever. But today's a great day outside, y'all. It's a beautiful 88 degrees outside today. Now, today is the hottest day of the year so far. Last time I know I said that, but this time it really is. It hasn't been 88 degrees yet. So as always, I'm going to try to embrace the day. But since I had to get my truck fixed, now I got to Uber all day to get that money right back. That's one thing I want to let y'all know about me. I bounce back from anything. I'm that person that will bounce back from the hardest downfall ever and get right back up. You know what I mean? I'm not trying to say this is a downfall. My truck fuck it up. Shit happens. That's why I always tell people, you know, always keep shit aside. You know what I mean? Reserve money. But um, I'm out to Uber all day, honestly, to get this money right back for real, y'all. When shit happens in life, you have one of the two things to do. You either can cry about it or you can find a solution. And I'm a person, I will always find a solution to all things that happen in life. Probably about to do Uber for a good seven to eight hours, honestly, y'all. And hopefully while I'm doing Uber, I run into something that's going on. Because, you know, it's Memorial Day weekend. Get out the car and go to some events or something or... Do something today, y'all, but I'm not really sure what I'm going to do today to be real besides Uber. Me getting my car fixed actually threw off my whole Saturday. Today, I planned on going like to a lot of events and stuff around Cleveland and just getting out here. But, you know, shit happens, y'all, and I just got to grind it out. But I'm not going to end this vlog here because I'm hoping I do do something later on. So, um, for now, though, I'm just going to see y'all when I see something interesting. And see ya. <laughs> that scenic view y'all that's one thing i do love about uber y'all it feels that i'm in control of my own time and that's the greatest feeling i feel i feel like many people in life want that want control of their own time the older i get the more wise i get i'm starting to see that it's very possible honestly to become a full-time entrepreneur not just for a plain old company but something that you love to do you know what i mean and I feel like this generation is really big on living their passions and trying to make their passions into like their job or career. And that's one of the things I'm definitely on, y'all. I know it's going to be a journey to get there. I know it's going to be a difficult road to get there. But something keeps telling me that it's possible to get there, that I'm in the right direction. And like I always say, I'm not sure it's going to get me there. But I know it's something that's going to get me there, y'all. But for now, I'm just embracing I'm just embracing life at this moment, honestly, y'all. I'm just embracing life. 